morning, you guys. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. Today, I'm not going to uni first thing in the morning, which is pretty bad considering I skipped most of my classes yesterday. But I do have a reason for it. So I need to sort my visa out. So I need to go to the immigration office. And then I'm gonna go to my afternoon classes at 1, have my practicals and stuff. So I will be going to uni. Um, but I will be missing a couple of classes and a study session with my friends, which I'm not particularly happy about, but I can't really help it right now because this is a bit more important. Anyway, so let's open the advent calendar. So here we have it. Um, today's day five. And it is a rocking horse. By the way, excuse my nails. They are super shit right now and I can't really be bothered <laughs> to wipe them away or redo them. So yeah, I need to go right now and I will see you guys later. now about a quarter past four i did have a little lab session but today was short because we didn't have to do much the bulk of the work is going to be done tomorrow tomorrow is gonna be pretty fun i think so we'll see what will happen tomorrow i'm sorry if this vlog for today is not very exciting um yeah that's what i did now i need to change my clothes probably cook dinner in a few moments but I really really need to get to work I need to catch up a lot of stuff that I didn't get to do because I missed the study group today so I need to catch up with the others so that I can actually do something and understand stuff on her next study session which is on Thursday but right now let's talk about something else so a few months ago I think it was like five months ago or six months ago even i made a video about what's in my uni bag and i used the bag that i got from primark about a year before i have a new bag now that i occasionally use to go to uni and i want to talk about it this bag is for those days that i know that i don't have practicals or lab sessions because it won't fit my lab coat which is a bit inconvenient because I need to change bag, like back to bag, but I really do like the bag. So this is the bag. This was actually sent for me from the brand, which is called Anna Grace London, for me to review. For a disclaimer, they did not pay me to say anything that is nice. Um, they did ask me to make a review and made a video about it, about what I thought, but I didn't need to say positive things about it so let's talk about this bag um 
it is very sturdy first of all it has a really rigid shape so it will hold the shape but the downside to that is that it doesn't allow you to get a lot of stuff in which is kind of surprising for the size of the bag because this is pretty big i mean this is i mean this would fit like my a4 college block no problem but for my folder which has paper running out of it because it's not clipped and probably because i have too much paper in it probably but for my um folder it won't fit as much like the length will fit but the width would not so i can't so i can't zip up the bag if i have my folder with me which is a bit annoying because i bring my folder everywhere with me because that holds all of my uni papers and stuff so that's a bit annoying and and here's my papers great and i've also still got my bullet journal in here and kit cats and my pencil case but that's not really important i'm here to talk about the bag so the bag is really nice it's really sturdy on the inside here you have like a pocket dot lining which is also nice it has a pocket for your phone and another pocket and then also an inside zip pocket and also one on the outside which i found really nice because if you want to find because if you want to find something fast you can do that with the bag the main problem that i found with this bag is that you need a lot of time to stretch it out so at first you won't be able to fit a lot of things in. I was only able to fit in like my folder and then my college book and then my pencil case and that's pretty much it because it was so rigid. I need to stretch it out, like putting more stuff in it, which surprisingly doesn't make the back look too bulky. It still retains its shape, which is great. I found it great. But the problem with that is that you can't really reach in and like, I don't know uh search for stuff too much if you have a lot of big items in your bag which is not great at times because it's just a bit too narrow like the zip up thing i haven't had any problems with the zip or anything which is great the handle is also very good i loved it um you might find that this bag is a bit heavy though for its size i kind of thought it would be heavy but not this heavy if i have like even without my lab coat it would get pretty heavy so i would prefer to use the shoulder straps which is fine i like the shoulder strap but i don't know if it's me maybe my shoulders are too narrow but it keeps slipping off my shoulders which sometimes can be annoying but i mean like it happens with every single bag so i don't think it's the fault of the brand overall if you would like to check out their brand i'll leave a link down below they are very affordable first of all also they are pretty well made they don't cost as much as you think i mean the bag ranges from i don't know about 15 euros to 20 ish euros so it's really not expensive for college students you can absolutely buy it they, are, they have tons of options like colors and models and stuff so check it out if you will if you don't that's fine um but yeah that is my new bag that i currently am using and loving and pretty much that is all for this little section i'll see you guys later so guys for dinner i made rice with some spicy barbecue style korean pork I got a recipe of a buzzfeed and I've already tried it like I think a week ago or something and it tasted really good so I wanted to make one again.
guys now it is the time to end the vlog tomorrow i need to be in the lab at 8 a.m tomorrow is the last time i'm gonna do organic chemistry the lab session i mean and i can't wait for it to be over it's been such a long long process anyways that's why i need to go thank you guys so much for watching this video if you liked it please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and as always i'll see you guys tomorrow bye